I've warned you, something monumental is on the horizon. Before the new moon, a rare and powerful cosmic event will unfold, one that could profoundly shift your spiritual path in ways you never thought possible. This event has the potential to transform your entire life. On this extraordinary day, the moon will align in a rare celestial occurrence, momentarily obscuring Spisa, one of the brightest stars in the sky. To an untrained eye, it might seem like just another night of stargazing. But trust me, it's so much more. This is a call from the universe, urging us to reach a deeper understanding of ourselves and the energies around us. The energy of this moment is unique, unlike anything we've felt in a long time. This isn't merely a spectacle to observe. It's an opportunity to tune into a cosmic shift capable of realigning your life's direction. The moon, which governs our emotions, intuition and inner world, will temporarily conceal Spica, a star symbolizing abundance. During this time, we are invited to reflect, reset and release what no longer serves us. The energy leading up to this celestial alignment is charged with potential. A chance to transform, let go of the old, and make space for new growth. Just as the moon eclipses speaker, we too are offered a moment to pause, recalibrate, and reconnect with the universe's greater plan. Ask yourself, what are you ready to release? What desires are you prepared to manifest? This is your moment to align with the cosmic flow and embrace spiritual renewal. If you're open to transformation, affirm it by commenting, I am open to transformation, below. If this message resonates with you, support us by liking this video, leaving a super thanks, or hitting the join button. Don't forget to click the bell icon so you won't miss our upcoming video on the new moon. Get ready, because the universe is speaking, and it's time to listen. As we prepare for this cosmic journey, let's first understand the mechanics of the celestial event ahead. A lunar occultation is both simple and deeply profound. During this event, the moon, our constant companion in the night sky, passes directly between Earth and a distant star, briefly blocking its light. But this is more than a fleeting shadow. It's a moment of transformation. The moon, with its ever-changing phases, has long been a symbol of cycles, intuition, and the subconscious. When it moves in front of a star, it doesn't just obscure the light, it creates a cosmic pause, a breath in the fabric of the universe. On November 27th, we will witness the moon eclipse speaker, one of the sky's most brilliant and meaningful stars. For a brief moment, Speaker's light will vanish, veiled behind the moon's shadow. This is more than a celestial alignment. It's an invitation to reflect, to question, and to pause. As Speaker disappears, the universe seems to whisper, what are you holding on to that no longer serves you? The hidden light of Speaker symbolizes a cosmic invitation to step away from external validation and reconnect with your inner truth. You might wonder, why is Spica's temporary disappearance so significant? To grasp its deeper meaning, we must first understand what Spica represents. In the vast cosmos, certain stars stand out, not just for their brilliance, but for their symbolic power. Spica is one of these luminaries, often called the Star of Abundance. It's a beacon of balance, prosperity, and the rewards of hard work. For generations, Spica has symbolized harvest and harmony. To the ancients, it served as a celestial mirror, reflecting the cycles of sowing, nurturing, and reaping, both in the fields and in life. It reminds us that the universe honors balance and timing. As Spica momentarily fades from view, it invites us to reflect on our own journey. What seeds have you planted in your life? What have you nurtured? And what are you ready to harvest? This rare alignment is not just about the cosmos. 
It's about you and your connection to the universe. Prepare yourself for this transformative event. It's an opportunity to pause, recalibrate, and step into the life you're destined for. Effort and reward take on a deeper meaning in this cosmic phenomenon. And here lies a unique twist. It's not just about material gain or outward success. This event symbolizes an energetic harvest, a culmination of everything we've invested in, our relationships, personal growth, and spiritual practices. It speaks to the abundance that resides not only in the physical world, but also within our consciousness. It serves as a universal reminder that balance and prosperity aren't mere coincidences. They are the natural outcomes of intention, effort, and alignment. When the star Spitzer is momentarily obscured by the moon's shadow, it's more than an astronomical event. It's a metaphorical disappearance of our own sense of abundance. This moment of absence offers a profound opportunity for introspection. The obscuring of Spicker's light asks us to reflect, what does abundance mean to us? What are we truly harvesting in our lives? Are these outcomes in harmony with our true purpose? Or have we been chasing illusions that leave us drained? The lunar occultation acts as a cosmic call to address the imbalances in our lives. As Spicker's light vanishes, it prompts us to look inward and examine what we've been cultivating. Have we been nurturing seeds of harmony and fulfillment, or have we been unintentionally feeding weeds that no longer serve us? This absence is like a pause button, urging us to reassess our choices and priorities. Imagine speaker as a mirror reflecting the fruits of your labor. What do you see in its reflection? This event doesn't just encourage us to evaluate our gains, but also to acknowledge what needs to be released. The moon's shadow doesn't erase speaker's energy. Instead, it creates an opening, inviting us to declutter our lives and make room for new blessings. Spicker, long a symbol of the harvest, challenges us to recognize what is ready to be reaped and what is quietly hindering our flow of abundance. In moments like these, when a star fades from view, the universe isn't merely taking something away, it's recalibrating. It's offering us a chance to realign ourselves with the natural flow of abundance, stripping away the excess to make space for what truly matters. Think of it as the final harvest of a season, where the fields are cleared and the soil is prepared for new growth. Similarly, we are being prepared for the next phase of our journey. The disappearance of speaker isn't an end. It's a reset, a moment for spiritual cleansing, re-evaluation and realignment. In the absence of the star's light, the universe encourages us to turn inward and ask, what am I truly harvesting in my life? Are the fruits of my labor fulfilling? Or have I been chasing rewards that no longer align with my purpose? This fleeting darkness is an invitation to confront our shadows, release what no longer serves us, and embrace the light within us that remains untouched by external circumstances. This is a time for deep spiritual recalibration, a rare opportunity for reflection and transformation. The disappearance of speaker is a gentle but profound reminder that to receive the abundance we seek we must first clear away the unnecessary and the outdated. As the moon briefly moves between us and the star, it offers the gift of stillness. In this stillness, the universe invites us to listen, to hear the whispers of our soul and reconnect with the ever-present energy that has been waiting for us to return. This event isn't just happening above us. It's a call to dive into the depths of our own existence. As the star of abundance fades into the moon's shadow, we are challenged to examine our alignment with the universe. Are we living in harmony with the forces of balance and purpose, or have we strayed from our true path? This cosmic alignment serves as both a reflection and a renewal, urging us to embrace transformation and step forward with clarity and intention.
the shadow will pass and speaker's light will shine again. Yet in that sacred fleeting moment when the star is hidden, the universe offers a profound opportunity, a chance to realign, reset and prepare for the abundance to come. In this moment, stay present, stay open and trust the process. The universe has a plan for you and it begins with this cosmic pause. As the moon obscures speaker, the guiding light of this star momentarily disappears. It may seem like a simple celestial blackout, a brief interlude where the universe itself takes a breath. But in the stillness of this cosmic disappearance, there lies a deeper message, a message that transcends the absence of light and touches the core of our being. When a star like speaker associated with abundance, balance and the fulfillment of efforts vanishes from the sky. It is more than the loss of illumination. It is the universe urging you to stop looking outward for guidance, to release your dependence on external assurances and to turn inward. The universe asks, what are you holding on to? What have you relied on to guide you? And does it truly serve your highest good? Imagine the sudden loss of your brightest guide, the star you've always looked to for clarity and direction. In the darkness, you're compelled to trust your inner compass, the quiet voice within that knows the path, even when the external world feels uncertain. This moment is not a loss, but a recalibration. When Spicer's light is hidden, it's an invitation to trust yourself, to recognize what no longer serves you and to release it consciously. This isn't about deprivation, but transformation. The universe is guiding you to uncover what blocks your natural flow of energy, what weighs you down, and what holds you in old patterns. In this temporary darkness, the clarity you seek will emerge if you're open to it. The energetic shift of this celestial event is profound. As the moon crosses the sky and veils speaker's light, it acts as a cosmic reset. The usual distractions, the relentless hustle, and the noise of daily life recede into the background, leaving space for reflection. This moment is a celestial invitation, a time to take stock of your life and release anything that no longer aligns with your purpose. This event is like a spiritual spring cleaning, Old habits, stagnant relationships, outdated beliefs, all can be cleared out to make room for new possibilities. As the moon moves across speaker, it doesn't just obscure light. It unveils truths, stripping away illusions and forcing you to confront what lies beneath. In this pause, the universe offers a chance to recalibrate, to shed the unnecessary and to align with your true path. It's not a time for fear or resistance, but an opportunity for trust, surrender and renewal. The energy of this moment is ripe for transformation. Imagine standing at the threshold of a new season with the air charged with potential. Before stepping forward, you must clear the way. Let go of what holds you back and make space for growth and purpose. This disappearance of speaker is no coincidence. It is a deliberate act by the universe, a call to deeper understanding and alignment. Trust this sacred pause. Within it lies the power to release the old, embrace the new, and step boldly into the life you are meant to live. The question the universe poses during this lunar occultation is profound, yet straightforward. What are you holding on to that no longer serves you? The temporary darkness covering Spiker is more than the absence of light. It's a cosmic nudge, urging you to look within and examine the parts of your life where old patterns, outdated beliefs, or unhealthy attachments linger. These might include a draining relationship, a career path misaligned with your purpose, or a limiting mindset that stifles your potential. This moment of celestial alignment acts as a cosmic reset, a chance to pause, reflect, and release. It's not just about letting go, it's about creating space, 
space for clarity, abundance, and what aligns with your soul's highest calling. Imagine it as opening the windows of your inner world, letting in fresh air, light, and the flow of universal energy. But the universe asks for more than release. It invites you to consider what you are ready to welcome. When the old is cleared away, what will you allow to fill its place? The universe won't leave a void. It will replace what's gone with something even greater. However, this transformation depends on your willingness to make space and trust the process. The energy of the occultation is primed for transformation. It's a time to shed the weight holding you back and create room for the blessings your soul truly seeks. This moment is about purification, renewal, and aligning yourself with the flow of the cosmos. The disappearance of speaker is not a loss, but an opportunity, a chance to reflect, reset, and realign with the forces shaping your life. As this celestial event approaches, remember that preparation doesn't happen only at the moment of alignment. Like the gradual movement of the moon to cover speaker, the energy shifts begin long before we perceive them. The universe gently calls us to prepare, laying a foundation beneath our feet so we can stand steady in the face of change. To align with this cosmic transformation, begin by grounding yourself. Grounding is more than a practice. It's a way of reconnecting with the earth and the present moment, anchoring you in the rhythms of the universe. Clear your mind of clutter, cleanse your spirit of stagnant energy, and raise your vibration. Each act of intention, each moment of stillness, and every effort to release what weighs you down brings you closer to alignment. This is a gradual process, not a single act. The more you prepare, the more you will resonate with the transformative energy of this celestial event. Embrace this pause. Listen to the universe's guidance and trust that with every step, you're aligning with the abundance and clarity it has in store for you. One of the simplest and most powerful ways to ground yourself is by connecting directly with the earth. Imagine standing barefoot on soft grass, your feet touching the soil. Feel the earth's energy rising through the soles of your feet, steadying and stabilizing you. The Earth's natural calming force clears away the static of daily life and helps you return to your center. If possible, spend time walking barefoot in nature, allowing this grounding energy to reset your own. If stepping outside isn't an option, deep breathing exercises can also serve as a grounding practice. Sit quietly, close your eyes, and focus on the rhythm of your breath. With each inhale, feel yourself drawing in the life force energy of the universe. With each exhale, let go of any tension, stress or negative energy. Breathe deeply, allowing your energy to settle and feel yourself becoming present, more attuned to the cosmic flow. Grounding can also extend into your physical space. The energy of your surroundings plays a significant role in spiritual alignment. Take time to cleanse and declutter your space, removing stagnant energy and inviting in a vibrant, fresh flow. You might light candles or incense and incorporate crystals like black tourmaline or selenite to clear negativity. Creating a peaceful and aligned atmosphere nurtures your higher self. Every grounding practice strengthens your energetic foundation helping you remain steady through cosmic shifts. Once you've grounded yourself, the next step is setting intentions. Intentions are like seeds planted in the rich soil of your consciousness, ready to grow as transformative energies unfold. For these seeds to flourish, they must be planted with care, clarity and focus. November 27th marks a time of cosmic reset a moment when the universe's energy supports transformation. However, this energy aligns only with what is true to your soul. To harness this power, reflect on what you're ready to release. Ask yourself, 
What is weighing me down? What patterns, beliefs or attachments no longer serve me? Allow emotions and memories to rise naturally during this process of purification. Write down your thoughts and desires, being specific about what you wish to let go of. The clearer you are, the more space you create for something new. Next, focus on what you wish to invite into your life. What abundance do you seek? What opportunities, experiences or qualities are you ready to call forth? Reflect on the peace, clarity or wisdom you wish to cultivate. Set your intentions thoughtfully, considering both tangible goals and intangible qualities like peace, creativity, harmony or courage. Let these intentions flow from your heart, staying true to your authentic self. The universe supports what aligns with your deepest truth. When your intentions are clear and specific, you signal exactly what you need for growth and transformation. This invites the energy of abundance, healing and alignment into your life. To guide this process, use a journal and explore prompts like What am I ready to release? What patterns or attachments no longer serve my highest good? What am I ready to invite into my life? What energy, abundance or transformation do I seek? Write freely and without judgment, trusting that this cosmic event will amplify your alignment with your true desires. Spiritual preparation isn't about forcing change. It's about aligning with it. By grounding yourself, clearing stagnant energy and setting clear, purposeful intentions, you create space for cosmic shifts to unfold naturally. You align with the flow of transformation and open yourself to the profound possibilities ahead. Waiting for the universe to act is not about being passive. It's about co-creating with its flow. This moment calls for releasing what no longer serves you, clearing both physical and energetic clutter, and aligning your heart, mind and soul with the cosmic forces at play. By preparing yourself in this way, you invite the transformative energy of this celestial event into your life. The universe continually invites us to grow, evolve, release and receive. The more prepared and open we are, the more fully we can embrace the transformations ahead. Stay present, grounded and trust the process. The cosmic reset is near and you are ready. The moon, our celestial companion, has always been a symbol of mystery, intuition, and the depths of the subconscious. Its soft, steady glow governs not only the tides of the oceans, but also the emotional tides within us. The moon represents the rhythms of our inner lives, illuminating the unseen, the unacknowledged, and the hidden parts of ourselves. It has the unique ability to amplify emotions unearth buried truths and bring our shadows into the light. During the upcoming lunar occultation, this influence will intensify. This is not just a celestial event to observe, but a profound moment for emotional revelation. As Speaker disappears behind the moon on November 27th, this cosmic shift will ripple through your heart, intuition and emotional landscape. The veil between the conscious and subconscious will thin allowing what was hidden to rise to the surface. The moon invites you to turn inward, acknowledge buried emotions, and bring them into the light of understanding. The moon's role is not to deny us its light, but to serve as a guide, leading us into the shadows of our psyche. When it passes in front of speaker, it is not an act of malice, but a divine invitation to explore the depths of our inner selves. In the temporary darkness, we are called to face our deepest fears, desires and unresolved emotions. Transformation happens in this space of introspection and acceptance. The light of the moon often reveals what we've been avoiding, hidden fears, suppressed emotions and neglected parts of ourselves. It asks us to confront these truths with compassion and understanding. What thoughts and feelings have you buried so deeply they're invisible to your conscious mind. 
This is not a time to run from these revelations, but to face them head on. The moon offers a sacred space for healing, inviting us to let go of what no longer serves us and make room for growth. To embrace this process requires courage. It asks us to sit with discomfort, acknowledge overlooked aspects of ourselves and accept them with love. Transformation isn't about avoiding the shadows, it's about learning to embrace them. For too long, we've been conditioned to fear the darkness, to see it as something to escape. But what if the darkness is not our enemy, but our teacher? What if the shadows hold the lessons we need to grow and heal? Embracing our shadows is a profound act of self-love. In the darkest parts of ourselves lie the seeds of transformation and healing. This lunar event is a reminder to approach the shadows not with fear, but with curiosity and compassion. It's in the spaces we resist the most that the greatest healing can occur. Trust in the process, honor your emotions, and let the moon guide you toward a deeper understanding of yourself. Transformation begins with embracing the totality of who you are, the light, the dark, and everything in between. The things we hide or deny are often the very ones that most need our love and attention. This is not a time to shy away from these feelings or push them deeper into the shadows. Instead, it is a time to honor them, give them space to exist and listen to the messages they carry. When a celestial body vanishes, leaving a void in the night sky, it's not merely an absence, but an invitation. This absence encourages us to explore the unseen, to step into the quiet spaces within ourselves and the universe. Just as the moon's shadow temporarily obscures the light of the stars, the lack of illumination provides a chance to see more clearly. It teaches us that transformation isn't about seeking more light or knowledge, but about learning to navigate the unknown, trusting ourselves in the void, and discovering the wisdom that emerges from facing our deepest truths. In these moments, emotions may rise, old wounds, feelings of inadequacy, or doubts about your path. These are the shadows calling for your attention. Do not fear them, embrace them. They are messengers from your soul urging you toward wholeness. By confronting these aspects of yourself, you release the burden of unexamined pain or hidden fear. This act of acceptance and healing leads to a more balanced and empowered existence. The moon does not cast shadows to keep us in the dark. Instead, it reveals a path to self-awareness. Shadows are not barriers, but opportunities for growth. By accepting their lessons, you move closer to understanding your true self. As you sit with these shadows, know that you are not alone. The universe itself dances through cycles of darkness and light, growth and decay, transformation and rebirth. By embracing your shadows, you become part of this divine rhythm. The moon, with its quiet influence, invites introspection. It asks us to face what we've avoided and dive deep into the subconscious. Its power lies not in what it reveals, but in how we respond to its invitation and the questions it stirs within us. What have you been hiding from? What parts of you need love, attention and healing? This is a moment of profound transformation, not just in the heavens, but within you. As the moon guides you through this journey, it encourages you to face the darkness, embrace your shadows and step into the light of your own transformation. This is the path of growth, the journey of the soul, leading to wholeness and empowerment. When the celestial event concludes and light returns, the energy shifts. This brief cosmic occurrence leaves a lasting impact both in the skies and within your life. The temporary absence of light becomes a catalyst for profound change, allowing you to release stagnation, confront your shadows and align with deeper truths. As clarity emerges with the returning light, what was once hidden comes into focus. Like a river, 
breaking free from a dam, abundance begins to flow, fueled by the shifts you've embraced and the intentions you've set. Think of this moment as a seed planted during the darkness, now sprouting as the light nurtures its growth. New opportunities, insights and pathways unfold, but like any gardener, you must care for what you've sown. The energy following this cosmic event offers balance, a chance to align your life with your intentions and create a foundation of peace, clarity and prosperity. The universe has provided an opportunity for renewal. It is now your responsibility to nurture this energy, stay grounded and continue aligning with your purpose. As the cosmic tide shifts and the moon lights up the night sky, you may feel the temptation to return to old habits, thought patterns, or ways of being. This is why staying aligned with your purpose is so crucial. The shift that happens during the occultation isn't just a single event. It's part of a bigger, ongoing process. The universe is always in motion, always evolving, and so is your journey. To truly benefit from the cosmic reset, it's important to stay present and aware. The energy of this moment is delicate, requiring your conscious attention. The intentions you set during the occultation are like seeds of transformation, but they need your care and attention to grow, much like a tree needs consistent nurturing, sunlight and water. Maintaining alignment means staying true to your path. It's about being intentional with your thoughts, emotions and actions. When you align with your highest purpose, you naturally attract the energies that will lead you toward abundance, growth and fulfillment. This doesn't happen by chance. It happens because you are committed to staying centered in your truth. The universe will reflect the energy you put into it. If you slip back into old patterns of doubt, fear or stagnation, you may find yourself stuck again. But if you remain present, with clear intentions and an open heart to the flow of cosmic energy, abundance will naturally start to flow. After the occultation, there will be a time for reflection, a chance to assess the shifts within you and around you. The energy of the moon and the cosmic reset will have cleared away old energies, opened doors and created new possibilities. But transformation doesn't happen overnight. It's gradual, and the full effects of the reset may not be immediately visible. That's why it's important to track your experiences over the coming days and weeks. Consider journaling to reflect on the changes you're experiencing, what emotions have surfaced, what insights or realizations have emerged, what old patterns or behaviors have you let go of, and what new opportunities are unfolding in your life. Writing helps create a sacred space for reflection, allowing you to process and make sense of the transformation taking place. In your journal, ask yourself, what has shifted since the occultation? What new perspectives or insights am I aware of? What feelings have come up that I need to honor? How can I stay aligned with my highest truth going forward? Through these quiet moments of reflection, you'll realize that change isn't just external, it's internal, too. As the energy shifts, you will evolve, your sense of purpose will deepen, and the clarity you gain will guide you in making decisions that align with your soul's calling. Transformation isn't a linear process. It ebbs and flows, sometimes subtle, sometimes dramatic. The key is to stay open, receptive to the wisdom that the universe offers, and allow that wisdom to continue unfolding as you move forward. As you move through the days and weeks after the occultation, take time to reflect on how far you've come. This isn't a one-time event, but an ongoing journey of growth and evolution. The intentions you set during this cosmic reset will continue to shape your path, but only if you stay present, aligned, and committed to the work ahead. The universe has given you the tools for transformation, so now the question is, what will you do with them? How will you carry forward the light that emerged from the darkness of the occultation? The cosmic reset is a profound opportunity, and with conscious effort, clarity, and deep alignment, 
the effects of this moment can continue to shape your life for days, months, and even years to come. This is your moment. Embrace it fully, reflect deeply, and watch as the universe, with all its cosmic energy, supports you in creating a life that is abundant, balanced, and aligned with your soul's deepest truth. The journey of transformation has only just begun. As we approach the moment of the lunar occultation, we enter a sacred space where the boundary between the physical and spiritual worlds starts to fade. It's like a heavy curtain, once thick and unyielding, gradually lifts, offering us a glimpse into a hidden realm just out of our reach. This thinning veil creates an opening, a doorway through which the unseen, the mystical, and the intangible flow into our awareness. In ancient traditions, this moment was recognized as a liminal space, a time when the lines between the known and unknown, the material and spiritual, blur. For a brief time, our usual perception softens and we begin to sense, see, and hear beyond what is immediately visible. In this sacred space, time itself seems to lose its hold. The past, present, and future converge into a single cosmic instant. The universe communicates with us directly, not always loudly, but always with profound meaning. During this time, the barrier between our human selves and the vastness of the cosmos becomes fragile. We experience heightened sensitivity where every vibration in the universe seems to echo within our hearts. We become more attuned to the rhythm of the stars the pulse of the earth beneath our feet, and the heartbeat of the divine flowing through all living things. This thinning veil invites us to listen, not just with our ears, but with our souls. It calls us to pay attention to the signs, synchronicities, and intuitive nudges that arise. With the thinning of the veil, our ability to perceive these signs is amplified, you might notice the universe speaking to you in ways you've never experienced before. It could show up as repeating numbers, chance encounters, vivid dreams, or sudden bursts of clarity. Initially, these moments might seem like coincidence or fleeting thoughts, but as you become more attuned to this energy, you'll realize that nothing is random. In a universe so deeply interconnected, every encounter, every dream, and every shift in energy is part of a greater, cosmic dance. A message meant for you. Perhaps you've been wondering about a decision in your life and suddenly a book falls off a shelf, opening to a page with the exact answer you needed. Or maybe, after weeks of uncertainty, you have a dream filled with symbolic images that seem to speak directly to your soul. These moments are not coincidences. They are signs. The universe is showing you the way guiding you toward deeper truths that you might have missed before. The thinning veil is an invitation to open your mind and heart to these signs. They are breadcrumbs leading you to greater alignment with your soul's purpose. Every moment of synchronicity is a reminder that you're not alone. The universe is conspiring in your favor, gently guiding you toward the destiny you're meant to fulfill. This time also encourages you to trust your intuition, even when it feels unclear or overwhelming. Intuition is often subtle, like a whisper in the wind, a fleeting thought from deep within. But in this sacred time, that whisper becomes clearer, more distinct and more insistent. Trusting your intuition is vital, even if the messages feel fragmented or confusing. The universe is guiding you in ways you might not yet understand. The messages you receive are often wrapped in layers of symbolism, urging you to look deeper. You may feel drawn to a particular path or opportunity, even if it doesn't seem logical at first. These intuitive nudges are not random. They are seeds planted within you by the universe. Seeds that, if nurtured, will grow into profound revelations. Your soul connected to the vast intelligence of the cosmos, knows the way. The universe speaks to you through your heart, through the subtle messages that arise when you quiet your mind and listen deeply. 
It's important to give yourself the space to reflect on these messages. In the rush of daily life, it can be easy to dismiss intuitive insights, especially when they seem vague or difficult to interpret. But this time, this thinning veil is meant to encourage you to slow down, to pause, and listen more closely. Intuition is not just a gift, it's a language. The more you practice listening, the more fluent you become in understanding the subtle frequencies the universe sends your way. Pay attention to the whispers, synchronicities, and quiet nudges. These are the universe's way of helping you remember your true path, your deepest desires, and your truest self. This is a rare opportunity to tune into the divine harmony that flows through all things. It's a time when the universe's energy is alive, flowing freely, and accessible to all who are willing to listen. You are part of that flow, an instrument in the cosmic orchestra. The melodies that arise now are uniquely yours. In the coming days, be mindful of the signs you encounter, the synchronicities you experience, and the intuitive knowledge that arises within you. Don't dismiss them. Lean into them. Trust that they are guiding you towards something greater, something beyond your current understanding. As the veil continues to thin, know that you're not just receiving messages, but being invited to embody them. Each insight, each synchronicity, and each intuitive knowing is part of your greater cosmic awakening. Embrace it fully. Trust in the wisdom of the universe and allow its energy to guide you toward your highest truth. As we approach the celestial event, we stand at a threshold, not only in cosmic time, but in our own inner transformation. Just as the moon temporarily obscures the brilliant light of the sun, this moment invites us to look inward and reflect on the seeds we've planted in our lives. What have we been nurturing over the past months and years? Are we cultivating abundance and vitality? Or have we unknowingly allowed seeds of doubt, fear and negativity to take root? Imagine your life as a fertile garden where every thought, action and decision is a seed you plant into the soil of your consciousness. What we do now in this moment of reflection will shape the path ahead. The intentions we set and the seeds we plant will begin to blossom in unexpected ways, but only if we remain aligned with the flow of the universe. This is a time to embrace change, to surrender to cosmic rhythms, and to trust that every shift is leading us toward a greater purpose. The universe has its own timing, and the energies now at play are guiding us toward the next chapter of our journey. So I invite you to stay present, to continue reflecting on the changes unfolding within you, and to honour the sacred space this cosmic shift is creating. Keep your heart open, stay grounded in your intentions, and trust that the universe is supporting you every step of the way. I'd love to hear your thoughts and experiences. What insights have you received during this time? How are you feeling about the journey ahead? Share your reflections in the comments below. And if this message resonated with you, don't forget to subscribe for more cosmic insights and spiritual guidance.